welcome back to my channel if you're new here then hi hello welcome come on in i feel like every time i do a styling video it almost low-key looks like i'm naked but as you can see i'm not today we'll be doing a styling video on how to style shirts but mainly a white shirt because that is my favorite one it is this one i thought i would just do a styling video of how to white style white shirts they're such a staple for spring especially summer as well and obviously now that the weather is getting warmer at long last I thought that I would just do a little styling video for you. So if you're interested in seeing five different outfits styled with like a white shirt, then just please be watching. Okay, so the first one is this. This is completely inspired by Lorna Lux. I'm sure you guys know of her. She basically did this and I completely fell in love. She took two different shirts and combined a dress from them. So this blue and white striped shirt here, this is from Misguided. And then this white shirt is from Zara. This will be the white shirt that I kind of feature in all of it. And what you kind of do is, my back is not tanned, so just please excuse that, is you tie the shirts together on one side, but my buttons from the blue shirt are too big for the white shirt holes. So I've only managed to do one, and then the rest is actually unbuttoned. But then you take the sleeves, which would be here, and then you wrap them almost like a belt kind of thing. Fan in love. It gives you so much like volume um, and really good shape with using the sleeves to tie. And I am just obsessed. This is definitely going to be an outfit that I completely and utterly, continuously rewear because it is gorgeous. Then I have just paired some white thong um, heels with them. These are from ASOS. You can always do sliders. I have paired with them sliders before as well. I think with loads of like bangles on and like a nice dainty necklace, it would be even more cute. But this is the first outfit and I love, 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 love. In my last video, I was like, I don't really like black and white outfits together and here I am in a black and white outfit together. Whoopsie. So the next one is one that I've worn a couple of times before. It's kind of like my safety go-to outfit if I'm like desperate for an outfit and I don't have anything new or anything that I kind of want to wear that day. This is the outfit that I opt for because it is so easy. It is so forgiving. It looks like you put in way more of an effort than you probably actually have because it's literally just a shirt. This is the same shirt from Zara. Sorry that it's not steamed, but you guys saw that I literally had it wrapped around my waist. So it's gonna have a little bit of a crinkle to it. The leather jacket is from Miss Selfridge. And then my boots, of course, of course, I had to bring out my thigh high boots. These are my favorite boots in the whole entire world. They're from New Look, they're a few years old now. They're one of the very, 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 very few boots boots that actually get past my calves so I keep them forever um but this outfit like I said I feel like it just looks like you put in way more effort than you actually have because it is literally just a shirt and boots and then again I feel like nice pair of hoops you could do like a really dainty or like layered necklace even would be really cute I'm kind of going through a thing at the moment where I don't really want to wear necklaces I don't know what's going on there but you know um and then I will show you it without the jacket you can even unbutton it more and have it more slouchy and off shoulder, but this one is, it's really nice and long in the back, but it's quite short at the front. I have a really, really long torso, so if you get this Zara one, it may be longer on you than it is on me. I've got a really long torso, I'm about five foot seven, five foot eight for reference as well. But if you find that it is quite long on you already because you've got a shorter torso or a normal torso, because I can see mine real, real, real long, then you can unbutton it more and have it proper like, I'll show you here, so I'm not flashing, but like proper, proper, proper off the shoulder. That's really, really nice as well. But yeah, this is actually one of my favorites. It's just so, so, so easy. And then I'll show you the boots, but they are literally just black, thigh high, faux, full suede boots and they're so comfy to walk in like these are my I wouldn't say everyday boots but like they're boots that I can do anything in I can do shifts when I used to work in retail in them and I did and yeah just a really really nice simple outfit and of course you can kind of change the shoe if you want if you want to do a colorful shoe a sandal a shirt dress I think is an absolute a staple isn't this just so bloody cute and playful oh, I'm still not in the shot I need to get better at this I feel like I need to figure out how my rooms in my apartment are so where the natural light is they're very boxy there's no like narrowness so I have to if you guys saw the position that you were in anyway 
So, this is so cute and playful. Is my bum bum on show? No, I'm okay for it though. Um, right, so we have our Zara dress on underneath, our little shirt dress. This jumper here is from Girl Knows All. It says Barcelona on it, it is cream, it is oversized, it is baggy. This is very much, a part of me wants to say picnic, but God forbid you sit on the grass with a, a white dress and then blame me. So maybe kind of like brunch outside, because that's what we're allowed to do at the moment, um, kind of outfit, and I love it. The little bag is from Primark. It kind of just goes with like the whole beigeness of it. And then the trainers are beige, black and white, and they're from Pumas. Um, I have like really large calves, which we've established from the thigh high boot situation. And I always like to do, I always think the idea of like the frilly socks turned over, make it look so cute, but it just doesn't suit my calves. If you like that, I would absolutely, positively add that to this outfit as well. I almost feel, this is very country club-esque. I feel like I'm in the housewives and that I'm going to play tennis, but not really, do you know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, this is what the trainers look like. Um, you can easily do heels with these if you want, but I feel like the whole outfit ensemble is just very playful that I wanted to keep it with um, trainers and just flats and just easy but yeah this is the next one and it's actually surprisingly very warm in here as well this next one is probably one of my favorites i mean they all are i love a shirt i really really do but this one i feel like you could play around with and dress up and dress down so much right so this one i've got the zara shirt again it's pretty much always a zara shirt this little bralette is from New Look. It's like a nice rose gold, glitzy kind of one. The jeans are Fashion Nova and then the shoes are the little um, ASOS ones. And then I just paired it with a teeny, teeny mini bag from Primark. But I thought this one is a really, really nice one for like going out with the girls, going on a date. If you're like me and you don't like your arms, summer and springtime is really difficult because you can't just put your coat on, which is what I, like, me personally, I'm kind of used to. So instead, we're gonna go for a really nice dress up underneath, like with the top, and then the shirt will make it a little bit more casual, but everything else being dressed up, like putting heels on and nice top underneath, makes it look a little bit more dressed up as well. And it's still lightweight so that you're gonna feel nice and comfortable. You're not gonna to get too, too hot with like a coat on or a jumper. Um, and yeah, I love it. I love the simplicity of it. And it's almost, obviously, you can always wear trainers or slides or like flat sandals and then easily just make this like a little shopping outfit and why i say it's so versatile is i have a really really nice um blue bra that kind of comes lower down because it's got like a nice little scalloped bit at the bottom and i have worn this like this with these shoes and that bra instead you can obviously just literally do the shirt up if you prefer it is so 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 versatile um, and I absolutely love it. I love these shoes as well. I can't stop looking at them. I went, I just went on ASOS while I got changed <laughs> into this outfit and found some more. It's like a hot pink one. And I don't really ever wear pink. Like this little bag and this top is as pink as I usually go. But those hot pink shoes, they're like low key calling my name, I can't lie. But yeah, this is the fourth outfit. And let's go and do the very last one. Okay, this one is probably the most easiest and most popular way to wear um, a shirt dress. And that is literally just as a dress by itself. I was actually gonna wear a different one, one that I have from Primark, but I can't find it. I think it's still in my summer suitcase, which I was gonna take out this week, but it's, um, it's currently snowing outside. So that's fun. Um, but no, right, so basically pop the shirt as your dress for the day. I've gone with about just to cinch you in because without, it's it's very shapeless. Um, so I've just gone for a belt, oh, and I've gone for a colorful belt as well. This one in particular is from Gucci. Obviously you do not need to go out and buy the Gucci belt in order to achieve this look. And then the sandals that I've gone for are orange as well to kind of tie in with the belt. It kind of gives that pop of color, which in spring and summer we are all about. Pretty much just that simple. This is why I like this shirt as well, because it's long enough in the back to be a dress. I feel like the only thing with this shirt that I keep noticing now is just how high this slit is. I kind of wish it was just tapered in ever 
ever so slightly ever more but that's okay because I still love this shirt anyway and yeah these sandals in particular are from Primark I'm so excited for Primark to open they open next week I can't wait I'm gonna do a haul don't you worry but yeah this is just super easy flowy outfit like this I would wear even shopping just so easy with like a little clutch with like a little bag just on um, and then jobs are good and then beautiful pair of sunglasses and then uh, just this it's just so easy it's literally a shirt dress with a belt and sandal this is it this is it for my styling video I hope you guys enjoyed it I will hopefully be doing some more I just really need to figure out a way to film it um i just i'm really struggling with that that's all because you guys are propped up on the bed the tripod i think it's on an angle which is going to annoy me when i edit this and it's just moving you up and down up and down i may just have to get one of my friends once we're allowed to just help me film but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this if, if you did then please give this video a thumbs up don't forget to comment share and subscribe because it helps me and let me know what your favorite outfit was Part of me wants to say this song because it is just so easy, but I really just love them all. Um, but yeah, let me know what your favourite was and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye. You can watch some TV, watch some Netflix if you want. You, you can come on over if you want to.